In this video, I'll show you how to sell items on Roblox. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like. And now let's go and get straight into this video. So the first thing you need to do is just head to Roblox just like so. And I'll be showing you two different ways or four different things you can go and sell on Roblox. Firstly, I'll show you how to go and sell just general Roblox items. And then I'll go and show you how you can sell things like your shirts and game passes and things like that. So firstly, you need to go and find the item you want to go and sell. So go to the left hand side and go to your inventory, just like so. Just before we get any further, I want to make it clear that you can only go and sell items on Roblox that you haven't made yourself, which are limited. So you're gonna go and see in your inventory items like this, which say limited, and this means you can go and sell it. For example, I couldn't go and sell these other ones. But if you're trying to find other things to sell, then make sure you go and check all these different categories as well, as there's quite a few. But in this case, I want to go and sell this inkwell egg here. So I'm gonna go and tap on it, just like so. And this is then gonna go and take me to sort of the sales page. And then to go and sell it, all I need to do is go to the top right like so. I'm gonna tap on these three dots like this. And what I can do is go and tap on sell. To sell collectibles or limited items on Roblox, you are gonna to need to have a premium membership on Roblox. I've got a full guide on how you can get Roblox premium. However, you can still go and sell your own creation, for example, your own shirts and things like that, which I'm now gonna show you later. And then what you can do is go and set the price you want it to be at. So at the minute, the best price is 80. So I guess if I wanted to sell it quite quickly, I could lower it a little bit. Um, but yeah, you could also go and look at the average price and things like that. So in this case, I'll have to go and tap on sell. And then I'm gonna go and sell it for 75 because I wanna get it sold quite quickly. But of course, I could also go and sell it for a bit more as well. And then as you can see, we've got the marketplace fee. So I'm actually only gonna receive 52 Robux. And if you haven't already, then you'll need to go and set up Authenticator, just like I'm trying to do now. I've now got an added an Authenticator. So now what I'm going to do is press sell now like so. And as you can see, I've now gone and put the item for sale and now somebody can go and purchase it and once they do you're then going to go and get the robux in your balance it's that easy now you may want to also go and sell other items that you've made on robux yourself to do that all you need to do is go to the top of robux and go and tap on create just like so and then what you need to do is go uh, and find the items so to do that you can go and tap on experience or avatar items for example and then you can go and see the items you've gone and made so you can go and choose between t-shirts, shirts, and pants, just like so. For example, if I wanted to go and sell this shirt here, then all I'd need to do is go and tap on it, just like so. And on the configure page, you can then come to the bottom and go and tap on on sale, like so. And then you can go and set a price. For example, I'll put it on for 10 Robux. Then it's for sale. I can press save changes, and now people can go and purchase it. And if you'd like to go and sell things like game passes, then all you need to do is go to the experience, which the game pass is linked with. I'll choose this game here. So I'll go and tap on it, like so, and then go over to the left hand side and I can then go and press on associated items just like this and then I'll need to go and select passes and then choose a pass which is currently off sale just like so so you can go and tap on it and then go over to the left hand side and you can go and tap on sales and then you can go and toggle on item for sale like so and then we can go and enter a price I'll enter five Robux for example, and then you can go and tap on save changes at the bottom and it's now for sale. It's that easy guys. 